How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. It's Turban Tuesday. If you don't know what Turban Tuesday is, it's where Playground Games give us a image which contains clues for what's in the new update. The new update comes out next week, or today we can try and use these clues to figure out what's coming in the update. So if you do like this video and you find it helpful, make sure to subscribe because we always cover this type of stuff on this channel. So, what are the clues? Well, this month's Torben Tuesday is quite an interesting one. If we go over to Twitter, we can see the tweet by Forza Horizon themselves, and it says one across, three across, four down, and then below it, we have the Torben Tuesday image. Pretty cool. Now, if we have a look at the text at first, we can actually figure out what all of this text means based on the emojis. We know that one across appears to be a sun with a notepad. Now, we believe that to be ray tracing you know sun rays and then paper you sort of trace onto paper so i believe this means ray tracing on pc this one here three across it looks like a rocket and then a bunny rocket bunny and then four down we have a donut and a camera donut media so this sort of confirms the basis of the update it's going to be donut media and we are getting rocket bunny returning the rocket bunny body kits and the top one some kind of ray tracing feature on pc as well maybe we're going to be able to drive around with ray tracing on pc in horizon 5 which will be very cool but the one across three across four down thing sounds a bit like a crossword well if we move over to the actual torben tuesday image now we can see that there is a qr code in the top right hand corner now we're going to focus on that really quickly first before we talk about the whiteboard but if you if you scan the qr code with your phone as you can see i've sort of screen recorded it and um, you scan it with your phone it pumps, pops up with a website and when you go to this website it takes you to the, the forza forums to a secret post where it gives you another secret torben tuesday image which is a crossword puzzle. Now we can actually use what they told us, the one across, three across and four down to add it to the crossword. Someone kindly did this on Twitter, so props to Forza Horizon World for that. But yeah, we can see we've got now a crossword puzzle. Now I'm presuming that maybe these other words, so two down, which is this one here, there's a word that starts with N and the penultimate letter is the letter N. If we can figure out what that word is, that may be a new upcoming car or feature or whatever. Now, based on the tweets that we were given, there aren't really, there isn't really much more information about what these other words are. It's all just, I guess, a guessing game if we want to try and guess what these words will mean. I don't know if we're supposed to figure it out yet. So just some of the guesses that people could make so far is the two down one, which is an N and then another N. This could say Nissan Z. So maybe it's a hint at the new Nissan Z coming to the game. It could be hinting at an old Nissan Z, so the 350Z or the 370Z. Now we do know that Donut Media have their own 350Z thing. Donut Media is the theme of the update, so maybe that's trying to tell us something. This one over here, which is I believe six across, something something M. This could say DTM. DTM is sort of a German touring car series, so German touring cars might be coming and um, it could just say Ram R-A-M so maybe that's a hint at the Ram Rebel TRX coming to the game there is a lot of possibilities of what all of these columns could be now obviously we know the main theme of this is Donut Media that is what the update is we know we're getting a Donut Media Horizon story and we know we're probably getting the Donut Media cars such as the high low cars and the cars like that that's what we need to remember when we're looking at this board. Can we see anything on this board that tells us which Donut Media cars we're getting, what the story is going to be like and stuff like that. If we take a quick look at the whiteboard, because the whiteboard's got tons of clues in it as well, we already know about the QR code, but let's start with the sticky notes up at the top. We can see that we appears to have a sticky note here that says any hints and it's pointing towards whatever it is, it's too blurry to really understand. But above that, we can see S14, S15, X16, S17. Now we can predict that that's probably talking about each series. So this is probably series 14, series 15, 16, and 17. Now this update is actually about series 14, I think. I do notice here that it's that between series 15 and series 16, the arrow seems to be pointing both ways, which tells me that season 15, season 16 will be connected. The reason I say that is because series 15 is December 
and series 16 is January. Now last year they did connect series, whatever series it was, they did connect January and December together so that all of the developers could have a Christmas break. So I can imagine that this means that this year when series 15 comes out we may hear about series 16 as well and it'll all be sort of connected in one big update exactly like they did last year. So that's what I think that means. Either way, it's obviously showing all of the next series. And what's interesting is in series 17, which is this one, which is actually a good couple of months away, it appears to have some words under it that appear to say story, chapters and challenges. So maybe there's a horizon story coming in series 17 and that seems quite underwhelming for them to put this on the board. But you may remember last week I did a video talking about why series 17 is probably going to be a big update. Yes, it's a good couple of months away, but they are, they are already hinting towards series 17. I did a video on it a couple of weeks ago about what clue they gave us to tell us that series 17 was going to be big. But yes, yeah, story, chapters, challenges, maybe that's related to series 17. Over on the left hand side, we have what seems to be the words coming soon and then the definition of soon below it. You can see it says adverb one in or after a short time. And if you look closely enough, it appears that the word short is underlined quite a few times. So it seems like maybe they're hinting towards the word short. Maybe they're really trying to sell us that something is coming soon, very soon. What that's going to be, we don't know. Are they on about, I mean, it could be anything really, but something is coming soon, like very soon in a short amount of time. What I found quite funny is this reflection here in the whiteboard of, a, uh, of this photo here. You can see the reflection through the whiteboard. I don't think this means anything. I think it's just a funny joke, but that's pretty cool. If we look down in the left-hand corner, we seem to have a couple of boxes. It seems like the, this one here might say 812 in numbers. Now, the Ferrari 812 Superfast, maybe we're getting a different variant of that. So this is just sort of throwing ideas out there. And there's a box to the right of it, which appears to say CSM. Now, I don't know what CSM it could mean. It might actually be the answer to six across because that is something, something M. Um, but what it seems, seems to be next to that is an arrow towards these two words, which appear to say car select. So maybe a new car selection option, maybe something like that. Um, it's, it's quite a difficult Torben Tuesday, to be honest. So make sure to drop it in the comment section below of whatever ideas you take from these crosswords and stuff like that. Um, let's have a look at some of the other things on the board. This right here, um, I mean, it all just looks like squiggles, but I can see a little bit of text here which seems to say ramps. So I suspect that maybe these two jagged things here are ramps. They've got red lines over them. So this might be hinting towards something Event Lab related to do with ramps. Are they adding more? Are they just fixing an issue with ramps? Um, is it some kind of track that's got ramps on it? Uh, we do know that we are getting a test track at some point that was leaked a couple of weeks ago now. Whether that's going to be in this update or not, we don't know. I suppose I see some stuff on here that's sort of track related, but I suppose we'll wait and see. If we look over on the left hand side, we have some kind of graph, which on the bottom it says skill and on the left it says challenge with a line sort of going up. Now this tells me maybe they're adding some more difficult challenges. The more skilled you are, the more challenges you get, the more difficult challenges you get. Maybe it's, I don't really know. This is this is a really difficult talk on Tuesday. Um, but possibly they're going to add stuff that's more targeting towards the more skilled players that find stuff just a bit too easy. And what it says on the right of that seems to be world change. That's why I think that says, I think it says plus world change. I really don't know what they're changing or anything like that. It's really difficult. Another bit of text here seems to say SS and then sort of three things next to it that say T2-1, T2-2 and T2-3. Are these like sectors, maybe sectors of something sort of one, two and three? I'm just saying what I think, so hopefully we can work together and figure out what some of this stuff means. There's a lot of text at the top of the screen as well, 
which I really don't know what any of it means. And then of course we've got the rest of the crossword to look at as well. I don't think the crossword is going to have much importance on it, at least not stuff we're going to figure out in the next two days. All of these down here could literally be any word whatsoever. It could be something simple like the word accolades. I'm sure we're probably going to get new accolades in this update for the New Horizon story. So one of these could just say accolades. One of them could say Horizon story, to be honest, just simple stuff like that. One of them could say achievements. So it could just be simple stuff. I don't really want to focus too much on it unless we get more clues. I've pretty much given you guys everything that I have spotted and everything we know so far. There are a few other things to talk about, like the sticky notes, as we talked about earlier. It says S17, and then these two don't say anything, but I'm presuming this one is season 18, and this one is season 19. What does this mean here? Is this saying something about series 19? It seems to say CZB or CSB. Is that something to do with series 19? I don't know. What do you guys think? I think we're really going to have to work together on this Jordan Tuesday because it is a very difficult one. One last thing to show you, which is potentially new cars coming to the game. The live stream is now up on YouTube for the reveal in a couple of days, and we have the thumbnail, which we can view. The thumbnail always has a hint or two in it, and we can see these big donuts um, for the Donut Media update. But what we can also see are two vehicles, this one, and this one now obviously they're very blurry and it's very difficult to know what these will be but lots of people have been guessing that these two cars are new cars that they're sort of teasing and not showing us yet what do you guys think what do you guys think that these two cars are um it could be nothing but they always do hide something within these thumbnails so potentially new cars for the time being this is what we know should leave a like if you've enjoyed everyone subscribe if you haven't already for more content just like this and i'll see you all later Bye.